Flu season is coming up and families can protect themselves with today's drive through vaccine event. TV5's Blake Keller is at Genesee Health Plan and breaking down what we can expect this afternoon. Good morning, Blake. Hey, good morning, everyone. So, yeah, we're here for the 10th annual drive through vaccine event here at Genesee Health Plan. And I think I see someone coming. This is a drive through event, so this is really cool. This is basically what you're going to do if you want to come down and get the option of getting a vaccine. So I have Genesee Health Plan's CEO, Jim Milnowski, here with me. Jim, thanks for driving in. Can you just tell us a little bit about what this vaccine event is, what you guys are doing? Well, as you can see, it's as simple as uh, driving in. Uh, there'll be a pharmacist kind of where you're standing, and they will give you your flu shot. and. Uh, we really started this 10 years ago. We moved into this building and felt, how can we use this garage bay and the, this idea, this concept of a drive-through flu a vaccine clinic got started. And so we wanted to make it simple so people can just come in uh, and get their flu shot, as well as we have so many other things that are going on as well. But uh, what I get, this is one of my most exciting days because uh, People sometimes bring their family, their children. We also have children's flu shots, okay. and it's great to see a whole car full of people. And it's like a, it's almost like your oil change. Every door they're at, they're at giving the flu shot and making sure that those folks are safe getting that and so forth. Over the years, what kind of progress or um, changes have you seen in the crowds who come out? Well, there's, usually people get here pretty early. We're here three to six, so they don't have to get here. There's plenty of uh, flu vaccine, so uh, we encourage people. But it, it's just like last year we had a COVID vaccine, uh, the, the new booster that came out. And so uh, people were lined up for that. Uh, we don't have COVID vaccine this year because uh, the new uh, booster's coming out and they, they just don't have the supply yet. But uh, it's just, and one of the, populations that we really wanted to go after was the deaf and hard of hearing. Yeah. Uh, and so we actually will have interpreters here because I, I can't imagine trying to get, get poked and not hear or be able to hear instructions or whatever. And so they'll have interpreters here. So if the deaf and hard of hearing want to uh, come here and get that, they can get that done. Jim, tell me uh, some of the vaccines that you will have besides just the flu shot. Well, our great partner, Walgreens, will do the flu shot in here. And then uh, the, the, our friends from the uh, health department will also be inside. They can do the flu shot. They can do what we call Tdap. That's uh, tetanus and diphtheria, all those. And even as adults, we need to get those, uh, especially we could step on a nail or get sick with that. What's nice about having the health department here is that they can look up your records. Uh, they can get on the state uh, immunization site. So they'll know about your kids and also yourself if you're due for some type of uh, shot or booster. So the process for someone who comes in, uh, there's, you know, yellow tape in the parking lot right here. So it's structured just yeah. for those who are coming, what to expect? Yeah, so staff will be here and they'll just ask for people's ID as well as if they have insurance. Uh, there, No one is turned away. There's no cost. There's no out of pocket. But if they have insurance that Walgreens can and Bill, they'll do that. Uh, so we'll take that information from them, fill out just a very brief health questionnaire while they're waiting to even get into the garage. And then once they get in, they just roll down their window and, and literally within about two minutes they're done and what's nice is right out front here there'll be ice cream so if they get their uh, if they have to get their flu shot to get some ice cream and then they can drive away being very happy so why continuously provide the vaccine clinic and why specifically this drive-through have you found it to be easier than normal clinics yeah, well, again, I think it's just something that uh, we wanted to make it fun first, but uh, flu is, is nothing to sneeze about, no pun intended. If, if you've ever had the flu, the, the flu shot doesn't prevent you from ever getting the flu, but it helps the symptoms reduce. So a lot of people have a lot of stuff coming up here in the fall. They have football games, they have Thanksgiving, they have all kinds. Of, so if you can get a flu shot that, that to prevent the flu from getting worse for themselves, I think that's great. Jim, I appreciate your time, of course, this morning. And then just a reminder for those who are coming out, there's obviously the free ice cream 
any other type of events or uh, activities going on we while you're here? The, um, uh, the clothes closet for people who, if they need clothes. We're going to be passing out uh, children's scarves and hats and mittens. And then we will also be having Narcan training. So the opiate crisis is huge. There'll be a Genesee Community Health Center training people how to do that. Jim, appreciate your time. This has been great. Very informative. All right. Thank, thank you. you. All right, so of course that is three to six today here at Genesee Health Plan. We're on Linden Road in Flint, so make sure that you come on out. You can also call Genesee Health Plan at 844-232-7740. And also join us later on on our Facebook Live TV5 news page on Facebook. We're gonna be live with Genesee Health Plan for an in-depth look at the vaccine drive through event that is today. I'm here in Flint. Blake Keller, back to you. All right, Blake, good job. We're